Hello, uh, good afternoon, <laughs> good afternoon. And, uh, welcome to today's live draw yep. for the fantastic Rickenbacker 90th edition 480XC. Yep. We just about made it after a few technical <laughs> difficulties. It feels like we say that every week. It does, it does. It wouldn't be a Northwest Guitars live stream without a few technical difficulties. Yeah, I guess it makes it more <laughs> exciting, doesn't it? Because uh, we never know whether we're going to pull Definitely it up or not. for us. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I think maybe uh, we need more practice. Possibly. Yeah. Maybe that means more live, more competitions. Yeah, maybe <laughs> we'll certainly get back into the swing of doing them more often. We've got some more guitars coming in next yes, week. We do. Uh, a few other goodies, which is nice. Uh, yeah. So yeah, I'm looking forward to that. Yeah. But yeah, we just made it in time. So if you're watching uh, at home, thanks very much for joining Thank us. Thank you for joining us. Yeah. Yeah, and uh, yeah, it's a bit of a close one, but we've done, we've done it though. We're there. We're here. Uh, yeah. So today we've uh, we've got something really special to give away. Mm -hmm. It's the Rickenbacker 90th edition 480XC in mm -hmm. Tobacco Glow. Yeah. A beautiful guitar. Um, you've probably it's, seen the pictures. Yeah, we've plastered it all over our social media and our website recently. It's a really beautiful get some guitar. Close of it if everything's working. Oh yeah, look at yeah. that. And like I say, it's sort of it's really sort of an untraditional shape for a for a Rickenbacker guitar. It's more similar to the bass shapes you normally see from from Rickenbacker. It's got the hot toaster pickups. It's all uh, Charlotte hardware, I believe, a Charlotte bridge. Uh, uh, yeah, it is. Yeah, and it comes with its own uh, sort of certificate. It's got a three-year guarantee. Yeah. It's a brand new guitar. Obviously, we don't raffle off second-hand guitars. No. They're all brand spanking new. Yeah, and this is really one of a kind. It's sort of a collector's guitar. I mean, it's definitely a player's guitar, but with it being a sort of 90th anniversary celebration of Rickenbacker being one of the biggest guitar brands. Yeah, it's a, it's real nice collector's item. It as is. Well. It's got some nice detail around around the sort of guitar body that sort of yes, unique it's, um, sort of dotted finish. Yeah. Uh, yeah, beautiful. Um, so and probably the most expensive guitar we've definitely <laughs> raffled off so far. Definitely comes in a case which you can see behind us. It's lovely inside, nice and plush. Yeah. I don't know if we can open it. Oh, it maybe uh, sort of a blue velvet. -y. Yep, yep. So you get the nice case with it as well. Mm -hmm. So yeah, nice, uh, nice first prize. And then we've got um, some pedals to give away. We actually, uh, what was it we? Advertised? So what was listed was the Fender Pugilist Distortion pedal. But I think what we've got, so we've got a couple of options actually. We've got full moon distortion pedal. The MTG tube distortion and a mirror image delay. Yeah, and since we've messed up, we're going to give the winner a choice you of three. Option. They can choose whichever yeah. one they want. Yeah. Uh, that's Dane there. Uh, hi, Dane. Hi, Dane. Uh, thanks for watching. Uh, good luck in the draw. I'm yeah, sure you've entered uh, if you're watching. Uh, anybody else that wants to leave any comments, we should be able to put them on the screen, I think. Let's have a go. There we yeah, go. Yeah, there we go. So, yeah, hi, Dane. Thanks for, uh, thanks for watching. Yeah. Uh, so yeah, a couple of uh, effects pedals to, uh, mm -hmm. to to use to choose from there, and then yeah. third prize we'll give away some web credits. Yes. Is it web Did credit? We not Is it t-shirt? T-shirt. I think I, we've. You know what? I can't even remember. <laughs> you keep you. you Phil, while I check this out, because yeah. I can't even remember what we did. Hi, Steve. Thanks for joining us. We're doing well. Hope you are too. Yeah. Just, yeah. Uh, let's just figure out what our <laughs> third prize was here. I'm sure it's a Fender T-shirt. It was Fender T-shirt. Yeah. So we've got. Uh, if I can do a quick screen share, if everything's uh, still working here, um, on our website, we've got quite a lot of T-shirts. If we can find them, uh, they'll be under accessories, clothing. clothing. So yeah, um, we'll get in touch with the winner. In fact, that's the wrong thing. I've got my specs on, and I can only see far away when I've got these specs on. Otherwise, it's a bit of a nightmare. So clothing and apparel that'll be the right one. So yeah, lots of fender t-shirts, hats, and stuff in there. But we'll give the winner a choice of uh, t-shirts. We've got them in multiple sizes, that kind of thing. So you can make sure you get one that fits. Exactly, and it's definitely summer weather, so you can you can get your fender t-shirt on at the barbecue or down at the beach, wherever you are. The Rickenbacker would be a power move on any stage. Do you what know what? It's oh, and just above that we've got better uh, shirt this week. What did you have on last week. time? I had my United one on last week. Ah, uh, yeah. So yeah, definitely <laughs> improvement there, Steve. Yeah, for sure. Yeah, for Mexican football fans. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, the Rickenbacker would be a power move on any stage. Yeah, it's a yeah. great guitar. It's really, um, yeah. it's lovely. Yeah, you, have you played it? I think I've had a little play of it. Yeah, it's definitely sort of it's up my street. It'd be a nice sort of Tom Petty esque sort of Rickenbacker, maybe a bit of. Stone a rock kind of guitar being yeah. played on that, but it's a it's a beautiful guitar, and no matter what you want to play, it can handle pretty much anything. Ah, uh, another comment there. Do you think you'll ever do a Tom DeLonge Strat competition? Well, we've been looking at them. Mm, we have. Was it the Strat? Was it no? The so we looked at the uh, ES three three five, which he's got, but he's just released the Strat caster. It's, yeah, it's uh, it's only coming out this. I think it I might think be this week. Month, might yeah, be today. Uh, so yeah, it's definitely something we're interested in. Yeah. Dane. So. Uh, 
And yeah, I'm we'll a see huge, if we can get hold huge of Huge Tom DeLonge fan as well, so we'll definitely get some Blink style riffs out of that. That'll be quite interesting. Yeah, it would. I would imagine it's probably uh, due to go up on Fender's website. We'll keep yes. an eye on it and we'll try and get one in mm -hmm. uh, if we can. We'll keep yeah, an eye on that this definitely. week and, and see what we can do. Yeah, yeah, be quite interesting. Sounds good. Yeah, even the Telecaster one looks pretty good as well, so we might have a double with that. There's a few signature ones we were looking at on Fender. There's was it Telecaster? It was a Telecaster, was it? No, not Tom DeLong. The Telecaster was, um, was it Jim Root Telecaster? We were looking at that. So, yeah. What, yeah. There's a few There was a couple ones. of Tom DeLong guitars, and so what were they? Were they? DES free free. Ah, right, right. okay, yeah. Yeah, we looked at quite a lot today. Yeah, we've looked there quite a few, yeah. Yeah, so we're, we should have a lot more stock in uh, yeah. within the next the next few days, hopefully, by the next competition. Yeah, yeah, definitely. We've got a couple more guitars on the wall that we, we've got to put on there, so we'll do that we do. a bit later. Mm -hmm. um, but yeah, I think that's it. So I think we should sort of crack on, maybe, yeah, and, and get on with the draw. Jump into it, definitely. Uh, okay, so um, if you've um, seen any of our draws before, you'll have an idea of, of sort of how we do it. We have... Um, a competition page here where you can view all the live competitions you can also view the entry list so if you've entered the competition and you you've probably got access to your ticket numbers anyway but if you can't find them for whatever reason then they'll be on here in the entry list we've uh, sorted them all in alphabetical orders just to make it easy so you can find your ticket numbers there really really simple and then all we do is we will draw the winners out we like mm -hmm. to just prove to everybody that we are live uh, and Google tells us that it's Friday, 21st of July at uh, 10 past 2. Got the so Friday dance. feeling. Spot on, yeah, not long to go. <laughs> a couple of hours and we go home. Um, and then we use this thing called the Wheel of Names to draw the winners out rather than using the random number generator that a lot of people use. So basically, you just click that, you click spin. It's very simple. It chooses a winner and that person has won the prize yeah. <laughs> and then that particular that particular number the great thing about this the way that this works is that number can't come up again once the winner's been drawn we close that down you'll see that number three has been taken out of the draw so if you've got multiple tickets yeah that particular ticket would be removed from the draw but you've still got oh, you other options uh you know other tickets but available there You've got a couple, got a couple of more comments there. Steve, uh, exciting. Steve's never entered. Oh, Steve. Uh, well, well, welcome, Steve. Uh, yeah, yeah, we've given away quite a few guitars up to now. We have done. Um, and we've we've sort of it's slowed down a bit since uh, since, since May, June, think, or since Christmas. Yeah. yeah. So we we're definitely going to get more guitars up. Yeah. We've got some amps at the back. We've got other things to give away as well. Yeah. So we're going to make this more of a feature, Steve. Uh, so yeah. So uh, yeah. Keep we, an, we an eye out to the next one. So hopefully we find something that Steve's interested in. Yeah, as well. yeah, yeah. So yeah, if you've got any suggestions for things that you want to see. Um, just send them in and uh, and we'll see what we can do. Let's see if I can move this camera a little bit. It's <laughs> probably a bit better. It's a bit better. Okay, so uh, let's not bore you too much with all the, the details. You can see all your ticket numbers in there. And then what we've done is we've created a spreadsheet with them all in here. And we just take everybody's name and everybody's ticket numbers and we paste that into our wheel of names. It takes a few seconds to populate because there are so many of them. Uh, I think there's something like 1,700, 1,600 tickets. I think something Around completely sell 16, out. Around 1,700, yeah. Yeah, so uh, still a good, uh, you know, quite a good showing. and mm -hmm. uh, It means, obviously, you've got a slightly better chance of winning than you would have had if all the tickets are sold. Exactly. I'm hoping this is eventually going to paste these numbers in here. It's not... Uh, we found when there's so many numbers, sometimes it, it can take a, take a bit of time. It is doing things. Them, but... It is thinking about doing it. <laughs> um, but it is not doing it at the moment. Right, let's try it one more time. Yeah, let's refresh it. It can be a bit ropey, this thing. It looks like that's the more, but I'm not going to trust that 1,611. Let's just make sure we've got everybody in there. Right, scroll to the bottom of this thing. 1,612, so yeah, obviously the first one is a, a header, so that's fine. And A done is the first one on there. Mm -hmm. So yeah, so everybody's in there, and the reason you can't see the numbers is because obviously it's so tightly packed in. It makes it a bit tricky to see them. Uh, what we're going to do is we're going to shuffle these names so they're all randomised, completely randomised, and then we're, we're pretty much ready to go. Yeah. Um, what's Dane saying there? Dane the bottom there. A two by the twelve or four by twelve orange cap giveaway. Pushing his luck a little bit. Uh, <laughs> we, we, it's, it's one to think about, it's, I suppose. I, do you know what? I'd love one day, and I'd, I'd have to enter it myself. But obviously, I couldn't win it, so I might put pause off <laughs> and getting one of those in. I don't know. We can certainly check it out. Plus, we'll we'll, yeah, I mean, we'll we can do. big space in here for it, so we could definitely get one in. Yeah, <laughs> uh, shipping it might be a, <laughs> a costly. <laughs> yeah. You'd have to come pick it up, Dane, if you want. 
Yeah, <laughs> yeah, pay us a visit. Uh, right, okay, so shall we, uh, shall we get on with the draw? So we'll yeah. draw for the main prize first for the rig. Uh, so yeah, so good luck to everybody that's, uh, that's entered this competition. And thanks for buying so many tickets, it's mm -hmm. been a real success. Um, so we'll spin the wheel. So the first prize will be for the Rickenbacker, and then we will hopefully hear from the winner at some point sure. in the day or two. We send an email out so we can start to find the winners. And that's totally firm. Oh. Um, so Tony, well done. Doesn't sound, doesn't look like he's watching. We've had a few winners that have been watching yeah, we as, they've, as they've won, and that's always that's always pretty exciting. Yeah. Maybe Tony's lurking. Maybe he's just not left a comment. But if you are watching Tony, or if you're watching it back, congratulations, mate. Yeah, well done. Um, like I say, we'll 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 announce. We, we tend to send an email out over yes, the weekend. Yes, yeah. Um, but feel free to get in touch if you want. Uh, yeah. If we don't hear from you, we'll be we'll give you a buzz anyway, so that yeah. we can. Uh, Sort of get this get shipped off to you as soon as we can, yeah. And then hopefully once you've received it and you've had a bit of a play with it, send us some pictures. Yeah. We always like to see um, the winners. Yeah, definitely. Uh, enjoying the guitar. It's always a, uh, it's always nice to see. Mm -hmm. uh, so yeah, so well done, Tony. Uh, be on its way to you at some point in the next will few be. days, hopefully. Uh, right. So next prize. Um, in fact, let's do. Have we got the pedals there? Are they yeah, all, so have you still got them all boxed up? They're all boxed up. We've got, but we can show up what we've got. Uh, so yeah, um, if you give me one, I'll grab one out there for you. Go. So these are really great pedals. We've we've given a lot of these away. Not sure how Fender feel about that, but um, well, but we've given a lot of them away, and they've been really really popular. The feedback we've got from customers. There you go. Uh, I'll give you that one. Yeah. You can show that one off if you like. Yeah, no worries. Do you want to just switch to? Uh, there. You do a bit of a close up on them. Uh, <laughs> if I press the right buttons this time. There we go. Okay. So yeah, really nice pads, really well made. Got yeah. a nice sort of brushed Oops. aluminium. So this one's a full immune distortion. It's really, it's a, they're lovely looking pedals, but they're also really good pieces of kit. Very reliable, sort of tactile. I mean, obviously when you're stamping on them all day, you want to be able to feel that response. Yeah. Um, settings, you can really sort of fine tune them. This one, I believe, has the, the magnetic. The snazzy magnetic. Uh, yeah. So that's where you pop your battery, battery in there. compartment that everybody at uh, Matt used to Matt, love. Matt, I'll call him Matt. I love that. <laughs> Raved about that, didn't he? He was yeah. with that. Matt, if you're watching. Hi, Matt. Still, <laughs> still <laughs> talking about those. <laughs> yeah. uh, those. Those battery compartments. Yeah. yeah, so uh, we've got three to choose from. Yeah. Uh, we'll let the winner know which ones we've got, and yeah. they can uh, choose whichever one they like. Yeah. Okay, so let's uh, let's draw that one then. So, well done to you again, Tony. Okay, so that ticket's been removed, so you'll see that the ticket number's gone down to 1610. So for the effects pedal, choice of effects pedals, that winner is... Graham Wyman. Graham Wyman. And you've got a choice as well, so... Yeah. Three pedals to choose from there, hopefully one of them takes your fancy. Yeah, uh, I mean they're all great, aren't they? So, they're all uh, fantastic. Whichever yeah. one you choose, you've got. Especially if you're a big fan of distortion, we've got two distortion pedals to choose from. Yeah, it's not a bad little second prize. I think they're all about the same sort of value, about hundred, yeah, over ten pounds, aren't they? Yeah. Uh, so yeah, so well done to you, uh, Graham. And that just leaves the third prize, which is the t-shirt. Which is the t-shirt again, a choice of those as well. So yeah, plenty to choose from there. We've got lots of different sizes, lots of different styles. So third prize, the t-shirt is going to Colin Hamilton. Colin, we'll give you a buzz, find out what size you need. Yeah. And we'll get one of them sent off to you. So <laughs> Payne, <laughs> Payne struck 01, which is quite an apt name for his comment, has just shouted no! Oh. <laughs> So I'm assuming Payne Shrupp was really hoping for the Rickenbacker, or maybe you want to defend the t-shirts, who knows. Oh, so oh. sorry, yeah, apologies <laughs> if, you, if you've been watching and you didn't, didn't win. win today. But thanks for watching, nonetheless. Yeah, I think, we'll, I mean, we can always explore the possibility of offering more prizes, so we've got more, so, yeah. more chances to win, that would, yeah. be, that would be quite interesting. Yeah, potentially we could do some sort of giveaway within the live comments, if we do a little quiz or a little competition. We did say, we did talk about that, didn't we? Yeah, yeah we would... Uh, do something like that. So we'll, yeah. we'll figure that out for next time and then it yeah. involves other people that way, to tune in and exactly watch. Exactly, those of you join us live get an opportunity to win something. Yeah, yeah. yeah. That'd be fun. We'll do that. Yeah. We'll definitely do that for next time. Um, some kind of question. And yeah. First one to get the answer right <laughs> wins a prize or something like we'll that. Make it, we'll make it easy. We we'll won't make it too hard. <laughs> <laughs> we can definitely do that. Yeah. So yeah, so well done to uh, all the winners today. Mm -hmm. um, please do send us some pictures in once yeah, you've received definitely. your items. 
Always nice to see. Yeah. Um, what else have we got lying about at the moment? So we've, we've got, got, I mean, we've got the long time favourite, the hit maker. We might have to stick this on next. Which, we might have to do like a little vote maybe and see what, yeah. we, see what we want to stick up there. Next. Again, they, they, we've had one of these before and uh, that sold out pretty much instantly. It was such a popular. Yeah, so we made two of these, didn't we? we? We raffled the first one off quite a while ago and it was yeah. really successful. Uh, one of the most successful raffles that we've done. It's been yeah. professionally reliced by. Um, uh, Aluthia done a really good job. It, it's very, very accurate. Mm -hmm. I'm sure yeah, Niles Guitar has picked up a few more dings. Yeah, maybe since, since then. then, but so we've seen how worn down it is on the neck. It's a really, really good job. Sort of age hardware you can see on the uh, locking machine heads, age sort of speed knobs and bridge. It's really, really well done. Sort of really well detailed job and it plays beautifully as well, especially if you're playing some Nile Rogers stuff. Yeah, yeah, it mm -hmm. is. Uh, it's pretty sweet. Uh, or relic, as you say. Virtual tuners on the back of it, yep. that sort of unique chrome plated uh, steel, I think, street, a brass scratch yeah. plate, sorry, uh, which is pretty unique. Yeah. Um, so, yeah, we'll raffle that off at some point. Mm -hmm. um, and then we've also got an Ibanez bass just behind yes, you. Yeah, if you yeah. want to grab that. This is another interesting one, it's a five string. Let me get a close up of that. Yeah. Press the right button. <laughs> there we go. There so, we've got a lovely five string bass. Lots of different control knobs on it. Yeah, which it I'm does not also. Entirely sure. Good. It looks like a bit of a spaceship, to be honest. Yeah, it's got Babbitt's bridge on there. Yeah, yeah, it's it's pretty sweet. Obviously, it's, uh, feels really nice to play as well. Considering it's a five string, I thought it might feel a bit chunky, but it's not. It's really sort of easily playable all the way down to the bottom. Um, I'm not sure what the machine heads are on this one. I'm not sure the shot is on there. I can't I think remember. They may actually. well be. Yeah, uh, but it's really beautiful guitar and lovely finish as well. So yeah. like natural dark wood. Yeah, and we've got a few amps behind us. Boss Katana, we've got a nice Laney amp that we've yeah. uh, been Laney. kicking around for a while. We just need to yeah. figure out what we're going to do about that. But I think we'll put some sort of package together as well, maybe mm -hmm. guitar yeah. and a Boss Katana. So yeah, there's anybody out there sort of new to guitar. Yeah, it's we've got the whole package there, guitar lead. Yeah, the Boss Katana is a, it's a fantastic sort of play at home or gig amp because you can kind of, it's got a few different settings for wattage. So you're playing in your bedroom, you're not going to sort of blow the ceiling off. But if you want to take it out, then you can. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Steve's comment there, well done to all the winners. Yeah, well yeah. done to everybody. Yeah, and Lola, I'll live vicariously. Good luck to the guy who won the Rickenbacker. He'll love it. That's yeah, well, hopefully, we, yeah, hopefully we get some pictures up yeah. uh, in the next few days of, of him with the guitar. Something that'd be good to see as well is a little video if, if people can sort of, especially with the pedals and stuff, obviously a photo of the pedal, we know what they look like, but maybe show us what they sound like once you get hold of them. Yeah. Uh, but even with the guitars as well, it's yeah, definitely demo. fun to see a little demo from, yeah, yeah. from the guys who, who win. nice. Okay, uh, well, I think that wraps it up for us I think today. That's, us for I think today. that's it. Um, yeah. So, yeah, again, well done to everybody. Well done, part. Guys. Thanks for everybody who bought a ticket. Mm -hmm. um, we'll try and figure out a way of involving yeah, all you, you guys you watching guys. there and, and giving something away to the yeah. people who actually bothered to tune in because yeah. that'd be nice. Yeah. Um, and yeah, we'll have a few more guitars in for yeah. next week. We'll get them up on the site as soon as we can. Some new stuff, yeah, definitely. Some more, and we've got some good suggestions today as well. So. You can have a look at some of the suggestions people are leaving. If you've got any more, leave them in the comments after the video. Yeah, especially the Tom DeLong strap. I'm sure we can do something. Yeah, there. definitely. The orange, the boss orange. Uh, the orange, <laughs> the orange <sorry>. cab. Yeah. <laughs> That'd be a bit more of a stretch. That something. might be a stretch, but we'll see. <laughs> All right. Well, that's pretty much it for us today. Yeah. Thanks indeed. very much for watching. I'll see you again, in a, I guess, in, in a couple, couple of weeks. weeks. Yeah. Have a great weekend, guys. Thanks bye for joining bye. us. Bye-bye.